hold off on using your red dragonstone 5 and consider this before you choose. How's it everybody? Celtic Link here. We're back for another Dokkan battle video. In today's video, we are taking a look at all of the units available with the red select character dragonstone 5. Five, right we've got a lot of special characters that are available of course we have the 120 leads available as always um and a bunch of other new characters added to the list so in this video we want to take some time talk about the units that are available the various levels of usage of this uh, stone and who i think you should save your stone for now let me first and foremost say that if you are watching this right now at the beginning of the countdown celebration you should pay attention to this little screen right here right you can see that the uh str broly uh dokkan fest the original dokkan fest is listed for two dragon stones that means i think there's pretty much a 95 percent chance he's the super easy a for the celebration so my advice is first and foremost right hold your dragon stones till the end of the celebration to see who the super easy a's are and use that information to decide who to use your stone right because if you already have broly then you don't need to use your stone on him but if you're someone who doesn't and you may be considering him right wait till we see the super easy a details um because that might determine who you use. So if you're watching this now, you know, go ahead, save your stone. If you're watching this in the future, right, and we've already had the reveal, then hey, tell us how good is this STR Broly um, and his super easy A. I bet he's wonderful. So let's go ahead and let's start talking about the unit. So first and foremost, right, the, the main featured units we have, of course, are, are these guys here, right? We have the Super Saiyan Tech Vegeta, Sub Easy A, like all of the three top ones are Sub Easy A's. And then we have the SDR Broly Dokkan Fest and then these, the AGL Turles and Tech Cooler uh, Sub Easy A's, right? And it's because they fit the categories Super Saiyans and Planetary Destruction, which basically confirms that at least one of the leads for each of the main Do uh, LR units for Worldwide are going to be those leads, right? I'm betting Goku is probably Super Saiyans and then Planetary Destruction for Broly, at least one of their leads. Somebody's a 200% lead. I'm betting it's Broly because I doubt they would give us another 200% Saiyans, Super Saiyans leader uh, since we already have the age, uh, int trio. So, you know, that's probably how this is going to work out. But however it works out, right? Save your stones and uh, and maybe pick up Broly if he ends up being a super easy. Otherwise, we have the 120s added. Um, some of these can be good, right? We are due up for a GT celebration soon, and there isn't much in the way of super easy A's for GT, which means if there is a GT celebration, we could possibly see 17 super easy A or one of the, the uh, STR Goku or the AGL Frieza super easy A. Otherwise, we have a new set of units, right? For three dragon stones, right? You can select um, certain easy A units and you can select what comes with them uh, with your choice. Now, some of these are good. I will go over all of them here in a second because this actually doesn't show all of them. But, you know, you know, it's you can basically get an easy A unit out of this stone for using all three of the stones they gave you. If you hadn't checked yet, you do actually have three stones instead of one. And what you'll notice here is like, oh, we'll actually go ahead and pull it up here. Um, if you notice here, it says three, but a lot of these other characters, right, besides some of these easy A's, can actually be exchanged five times, which makes me think we're still getting two more stones somehow, some way at this during this celebration. Unless that's just they decided for some weird reason to do that. But you can see that all of these characters, right, are available for three, right? The in their sub easy A's or easy A's, like the uh, easy A 13, right? If you pick him up, you get him plus an elder Kai. Right, so, I mean, some of them have use, uh, not the best use. 13 can still play some use around movie bosses and artificial life forms. Um, he does want to be around androids and target Goku, so there's some use there. Jiren, definitely going to need, uh, even though he's not the best, right, we need the Universe 11 characters for that Universe 11 mission. So, right, when AGL Jiren finally comes... He could find some use. I don't think he's worth three stones kind of finding use, but I mean, it's there. If it's all you're missing, then, you know, it is there. Otherwise, let's move on down the list, right? So we've got all of the sub EZAs from last year's Worldwide for three, right? And again, just like all the others, they do come with an Elder Kai, 
right? We have the end Gohan sub uh, super, uh, Easy A, Tech Trunks Easy A, then the sub Easy A, AGL's uh, Zamas, um, the Peppy Gals, and then the previous worldwide Easy A's, all for, um, right? Or the Peppy Gals Easy A, sorry, right? So all of those cost three stones. I, I mean, they. There is some use for a lot of these units, but I don't think any of them are worth the three stones. So moving into the next set of units, the two stone units, starting with the Broly, right? Broly is probably going to be your most likely candidate if you don't have them, considering he's due up for a super easy A. Um, otherwise, you could probably pick up, I would say your top choices are one of the four current super easy A's. Goku, Gotenks, Boo, or Goku Black, whichever one you're missing. You'll notice each one of those is only going to cost you one. So picking them up still gives you two more, right? So if you didn't have Broly and you didn't have one of these guys, you could easily pick up a copy of both, right? Um, so there's definitely value there. Otherwise, coming on down, right, we move into the 120s, right? Vegito Blue, AGL Rose could definitely see a super, pretty much anybody 120 and below could see a super easy A. Although I do think the 120s are less likely there's still a chance because like a lot of the characters that are there are pretty limited in who they are right like i mean there's even a chance that this guy the super saiyan 3 broly could super easy a right i mean that's there's always that chance um moving on into right the 100 percent leads or the original 90 percent leads right notice you can pick these guys up three times um and any one of these guys could easy a at any moment uh given the ones that have already easy a from this group and then of course we get down to the last of the original dokkan fests um gogeta super saiyan 3 vegeta um and is janemba on here uh no actually and janemba isn't on here right so right um any of these guys could potentially super easy a in the near future fizz broly um although again str broly i think is the more likely candidate so what i would say is pick based on what you need that's always my recommendation from this but i mean if you if you didn't have anything my number one picks are the super easy a's you're probably going to get the most use right as a brand new player you're probably going to get the most use out of super saiyan 3 goku he's so versatile he fits on so many different teams he's going to help carry you through a lot of content if you're more on the support side of things fizz goku black uh not goku black fizz Kid Buu is probably a good option for you. He will help support your team on the teams he can be run. He supports both Super and Extreme Class. He's very, very useful, right? Any one of these four is a good choice for, right, your stones. You could easily pick up three of these if you were missing all of them. Or you can wait for Broly if you didn't have them. But I do think uh, if you're not going to wait, or if you're watching this in the future and you've already picked up your copy of Broly, these guys are definitely worth the one stone. I don't think there's a single character that's worth the three stones, unfortunately. Um, otherwise, outside of that, I do think uh, top choices are probably considering future EZAs. I feel like this cell is probably going to be coming up here very, very soon. Um... And there's a chance that Gogeta will super easy a during 10th Annie in February. So those are probably my top picks just kind of based on what's been happening with Dokkan. 120s are very less. I mean, they are possible, right? Based on the theme of the celebration. But I do think they're far less likely than some of the other choices. So again, top choices, Super Saiyan 3 Goku or Fizz Kid Boo. And then um, wait for Broly, right? First and foremost. So... Guys, that is it for the video. If you like the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And in the comments down below, let us know, who are you going to pick with your stone? Do you think any of the three stones are worth it? Or are you going to just wait till we get Broly's details? Honestly, my Broly is 55%. I'm probably just going to wait for him. Um, so that way I can have a free 79% copy, which will be great for showcases. And then I'll grab one of the other. I think the last 120 I'm missing is STR Janemba. So I'll probably grab him. So... Let us know who you're thinking about grabbing in the comments down below. Otherwise, guys, as always, thanks for watching and aloha.